I used to spend my nights down in the bar room. Liquor was the only love I ever knew. Oh. Well, I was a narcissist, you know. <laughs> so then I started, uh, I started uh, Id- idolizing this woman. Yeah. Pedicle. Because you know she kept me from reaching for the bottom. Mm. Uh, she stopped me from being too far gone. Yeah. She brought you back. But but you know she was just human, <laughs> and I was idolizing her, making her out to be something she wasn't. And oh my God, it got complicated. Live from the Brawler Room, <laughs> it's a really big old time radio medicine show. Three chords and the truth, your life will never be the same. Now listen to me. Jimmy Joe's on his way to pick you up in the uh, limo, and uh, he's going to put a song on the radio from back. We're taking you back to the decade of uh, 1973. Yes, it is, 1973. And who would be the, uh, whose song is it, Mo? 66. It's Walk Through This World With Me, Dad. Okay, this is George Jones, and I think I heard... uh, who else? Allison Cross? Yeah, I think you talked about that. Uh, somebody else. Yeah. But you know, all we got to do is know George did it. She did. She does shit really good too. She does. Yeah. She's solid. Nice. You guys hear that helicopter? <laughs> Walk through this world with me. Go where I go. Share all my dreams with me. I need you so. Oh, you know that in life we search. And some of us find. I've looked for you. Such a long, long time And now that I find you New horizons I see Come take my hand Walk through this world with me Come take my hand Walk through this world with me Walk through this world with me. Go where I go. Share all my dreams with me. I need you so. Oh, you know that in life we search. And some of us find. I've looked for you. Such a long, long time And now that I find you New horizons I see Come take my hand Walk through this world with me Come take my hand Walk through this world with me Come take my hand, walk through this world with me. Walk through this world with me, with me and George Jones. Yeah. Now listen, where are we? Oh yeah, the uh, limo is just pulling up. So just it's pulling up like just outside the door to your mind. In five, four, three, two, one. Slip yourself into the back there. It's like a Xanadu Valley Pleasure Home Decree because we got to take a ride. We're going to take a ride up as a honky tonk. Up as a honky tonk. Past the county line. And past the county line. Through the amber waves of green. And past the dairy cow. With a big brown eye. To the old county line road. Cornfield, the cornfield, cornfield of dream. Cornfield of dream. Yeah. Cornfield, cornfield of dream. 
Now this is where the old singers come out. It's kind of like Kevin Costner's Field of Dreams, right? Yeah. Only Molly can see them. Yeah. And then they make requests, right? Yeah. Who's coming out tonight? Oh. Well, you know, Dad, I think everyone can see who's coming out tonight because these guys aren't dead either. What's going on? It's uh, Patty Loveless and Dwight Yoakam. Oh. Well, they're a long way from gone. <laughs> but they sure like visiting in the cornfield, oh, yeah. don't they? It's they do, they visit. It's visitor's week for the cornfield. They get to see yeah. Hank Williams Sr. and Johnny Cash and Merle Haggard. They're all there, you know, yeah. drinking the corn liquor the corn because liquor. they're making corn liquor in that cornfield. Yeah. Okay, now what do, um, who is it again? <laughs> Send a message there. Patty loves this. Enjoy you. In a beat. Oh. Get it up there in a beat. Is that song exciting enough? It is exciting All enough. Right. All right, we'll do it. It's a duet. <coughs> It'll do it. They're both, uh, uh, Dwight and uh, Patty are both from Kentucky. Was the first song on our first set. Yeah. It's real yeah. important. For many years. Send a message to my heart On the wings of the wind Let me hear your sweet voice saying You love me again Even though we're apart I still hold your memory Send a message to my heart Keep you here with me. Send a message to my heart. Keep you here with me. Darling, when we're all alone, tell me, do you think of me? And does my name touch your lips? Am I still in your dream? Do your arms reach out for mine In the still of the night Do you wish that I was with you When you turn out the light Send a message to my heart On the wings of the wind Let me hear your sweet voice say you love me again, even though we're apart. I still hold your memory. Send a message to my heart. Keep you here with me. Send a message to my heart. Keep you here with me. Still, we're out at the cornfield. You got uh, who else is anybody else coming out of there? No, no, Dad. Nobody. Oh, the Crosby, Stills, and Nash didn't come out of there. They could. Do you want them to? Yeah. <laughs> get it. <laughs> 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 They're still alive. They got 
like Instagram and stuff. Well, you're bringing live <laughs> people out there. You're do, you're doing fancy things. Whatever. Uh, we want to get back in the uh, back in the limo get then. The limo. Everybody dive back in because we're heading out to the old radio station where the Griffin Art Studios is, uh, where the broiler room is for the show. On the old country road. And on the girlies too. All the girlies too. Hanging out of the window. Hanging out of the window. Somebody sees a great big tower. Woo! Fifty thousand watts. Station G H R T. Station G H R T. It's there for you and me. It's there for you and me. Brought to you by Alice's Restaurant and General Store. You can get anything you yeah, want. Anything you want. Down at Alice's Restaurant. Oh, down at Alice's Restaurant. You can pull in the old station, go up to the front desk, and see Betty Page in her cigarette girl uniform. She'll give you your special tea, special the Hiawaskan, and send you down the stairs here. The psychedelic prairie home companion. Uh, grand old the Grand Ole Osprey, yeah. like the bird. Yeah. Uh, only it's really the really big old time radio medicine show, Three Chords and the True, starring Molly Griffin and her old dog, too. And the Reverend Dr. Joe G, too, coming to you live from Station GHRT in the virtual haystack in your mind, where the show always starts in five minutes. And we don't spin the tunes on the turntable, we spin them on our souls. So kick back, chill out, and relax to the mellow sounds of the singing DJ. Oh, spin them on our soul. Spin them on our soul. Sometimes we spin them on our heart. Spin them on our soul. Ba-boo-ba-dee-oo-ba-boo-ba-dee-oo-ba-boo-ba-boo-ba-boo-ba-boo-ba-boo-ba-boo-ba-boo-ba-boo-ba-boo-ba-boo-ba-boo-ba-
Felt it coming out. He does it that like two more times. That's how he ends it. Squeeze the pig because I'm always writing on it. You know, writing it direct. <laughs> and she, she's learned how to sort of feel you know, wh where I <laughs> what I want. <laughs> oh, yeah. You're as smooth as a Tennessee whiskey. Now, yeah, that's what play Ask for Americana. First song uh, up. That's a first, good choice. First song up. Because it's like now, it bridges it's a lot of... And it's fairly new, too, yeah. right? Now, here's another one for you. Because uh -huh. you might find this good, right? Because we got them both now if we get that one in. Yeah. But anyways, um, alt, 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 alternative yes. country. Okay. First song up. I don't know. Gentle on my mind. <laughs> oh. How do you like that? Interesting. Yeah, I, I know, really but they know how to pick country. a song, right? Yeah, it's a good one. Yeah. I know, because people were <laughs> saying on ours out there, we're going, oh, my God. Yeah. They like it. Yeah, it's a good one. It's, it's a, good, a good one. Yeah. Once in a blue moon, the guy writes Is it the, the song. original version, or is it the Band Perry version? I don't know nothing about the Band the Perry. The, you know, the new, newer version of it. Uh, I like it. I thought it was really good. Perry. Yeah, is that any relation to Perry Como? <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> Get out of here, old man. <laughs> 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 All right. Do you want to sing the Eagles now, or do you want to go see the old talking? guy way in the back of the factory? <laughs> he owns it. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you say, Ma? Lion eyes or teach your children? Oh God. Teach your children lion eyes. Well, I like to say something say so something. that when we blow the song, they'll they'll come back just because. Yeah, but he said some cool things in between. Well, let's do teach your children first, because I feel like we're gonna we're a little less likely to embarrass ourselves. Hold it! Here's <laughs> a, here it is. Here it is, coming from the good book right now. Well, mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure of two things. We got something huge here. Yeah. And it's time to call the pros from Dover in to take over, yeah. because I'm finished with the internet. <laughs> 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 oh, God. <laughs> I do my promoting in the recording studio and, you know, yeah, yeah, television. Yeah. Yeah. That's what. Get the other people to do it. <laughs> 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 um, oh, this is another one, just quick, okay? Yeah. You know, one of the most dangerous, it suddenly dawned on me the, the other day. Oh, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say this and then I'm going to go. Yeah. I'm going to go to the the thing I wrote <laughs> 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 so everybody can see how weird I am, <laughs> right? Okay, so what does this say? One of the most dangerous things I do, because you know I've got my own writing place, right? I need the solitude. Yeah. But one of the most dangerous things I do is write comedy down there mm -hmm. because I'll throw a fit. <laughs> and I don't know what might happen to me, <laughs> because you know, I, my my whole family used to do that. My dad, my sister, uh, conniptions. Well, if you go that way, it's a good way to go, you know. And kind of this ideal. is what's going to be so interesting about this. Yeah. Oh God, I went too far. <laughs> yep. Hold on. I got it here. Put your head in the game. So 
I went way too far. <laughs> uh, you know that Billy Currington song mm -hmm. that we do? Yeah. Uh, it's called... Uh, come closer, come closer. It's called What's a Guy Gotta Do? That is not Billy Currington. That is John Anderson. Oh, not John Anderson. No, uh, John Joe Nichols. Joe Nichols. Yeah. yeah, What's a Guy Gotta Do to Get a Girl in This Town? Yeah. What's a guy got to do to get a girl in this town? Yeah, we do it anyways. Yeah. Well, I'm writing one that is more politically correct. Yeah. It's called, What's a man got to do to get a man in this town? <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Okay, now listen. When I wrote Fabulous. that, I just completely <laughs> dropped my drawers. I couldn't <laughs> stop laughing for about 10 minutes, but I delivered it perfectly to myself, right? <laughs> In my head. I know. It was hilarious. I I had to have that problem with reading jokes. I think everything's funny, and then I show it to someone else, and they don't think it's that funny, and go, well, you must not be very good at delivering well, it to yourself. Well, uh, <laughs> it's uh, set and setting. Yeah. You know? <laughs> <laughs> and that's why this show is so popular. We don't just talk about writing the songs, because we do write songs, real, gall darn good songs, yeah. <laughs> and uh, commercial songs. Yeah. And... Uh, the comedy do is he was talking about like how we make the shows. Yeah. Not shit. I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Dad. I said how we make the show <coughs> and shit. Yeah. We'll see your uh, Reuben about that. <laughs> we can all observe him. He's a tiny child. He's a tiny little tiny. <laughs> now, okay, here and this is what he's got to <laughs> learn right here. He's got to learn this right away. Yeah, don't expect me to sing any any leads here. Okay, I'll just sing a couple I know then. Yeah. City girl just seemed to find out earth. How to open doors with just a smile. Rich old man on, she won't have to worry. She dress up autumn lace and go in style. You can't hide your lying eyes and your smile. It's a thin disk. I thought by now you'd be alive. Oh, ain't no way to hide your lying now. Oh, honey, you can't hide your lying now. She tells him she must go out for the evening. Comfort an old friend who's feeling down. But she knows where she's going and she's leaving. She's headed for the cheating side of town. You can't hide your life. And your smile is a thin disguise. Oh, man, I thought by now you'd be alive. It ain't no way to hide you. gets up and she pours herself a strong and dreams about a boy she knew in school another night it's gonna be a long she's so far gone she feels just like a fool you can't hide your lying eyes 
and your smile is as in disguise. Woman, I thought by now you realize ain't no way to hide your life now. Oh, ain't it funny you can't hide your Can't hide your lion eyes. I think you were missing one chord. No, 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 no. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll tell you later. later. I'll tell you later. <laughs> squeeze I'll the tell pig. You later. Wait, you gotta remember to squeeze. All you gotta remember is one thing. When I start talking yeah, about that crap, thing. squeeze <laughs> that pig. <laughs> Have we done them all now? No, we oh. gotta do teach your children. Teach your children, Dad. Teach your children. We got time to do a song we know. Nope. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> you're gonna have to put up with this. Watch the third, third one this week. It'll be better. <laughs> uh, watch the trailers. Trailers will be good. But uh, you won't get the learning process. You won't get the evolution, Ma. Yeah. It's very important. We're not talking about evolution, are we? <laughs> What's the problem? I'm watching you. You're looking down there I'm like you're really looking. busy. I'm what do you want to do? Teach your children. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm not going to try and follow that Billy Currington joke. No. It's just too funny. <laughs> Wait a minute. I'll look and see. No. They were both good, but I've done them both. Yeah. What is it? Teach your children. Oh, okay. You. You don't know any verses either, eh? Are no. you going to try the second one? I could try the second one. You. Holy mom. i got to get a better you. All right. You who're on the road must have a code that you can live by and so become yourself your father's hell is slowly going by keep your children well is slowly gone by don't you ever ask them why if they told you you would cry so just look at them and sigh I'm right in there again, Ma. <laughs> hey, 
pig. You want to have a look at the pig? She's a real good looking pig. I love me some pig. Love pig man. Yep, yep. Okay, listen. We know your life will never be the same. And poor the better, I should say. Because uh, you saw the really big old time radio medicine show. Three chords and the truth. And y'all come back now. But first, keep the cards and letters coming in. We'll see you in the funny papers. And so long, pilgrim.